Hi guys, welcome back to another video and today we're going to be showing you some reviews, all the reviews for Funcon Day 2. Now, there wasn't much really that I liked from Day 2. I mean, there's not much Marvel. Just like, it's all like last San Diego Comic Con when they didn't do much Marvel pops. They did do a couple because... They did do a Back to the Future pop though, which I do like. I do collect that line. Some of these lines that they announced today, I just don't collect. So let's just start from the first one. So the first one we have is they have announced a couple of Star Wars ones, which mainly for for a con they normally do announce Star Wars ones. But here we have a Ray Jakku. Version, so it's sort of like a planet, I believe, Jakku. But here's Ray. And look, I I don't have many Star Wars Funko Pops. I don't collect most of them, but I collect some of the ones that I like. But she's cool, and nothing really else to say about her because we've already gotten Ray Funko Pops in the past. So let's just move to the next one. So the next one we have is Imperial Super Commando from the Star Wars Rebels. Now this one, I do like this one a little bit better than the Ray just because we haven't got this pop yet. And I'm sure a lot of people do like Rebels, but again, it's not a TV show or I think it's a TV show that I watch. So fortunately... Not a, not one that I'll be getting, but you know there's a lot of Marvel fans that are very surprised that there's hardly any Marvel pops. But there is one that I will get onto right now. So this one here is Cap Wolf. Now I believe. The shared version, I think it's a shared version, has no sh Year of the Shield sticker, but the normal stickered one has the Year of the Shield sticker on. So, this is Cap Wolf. I'm not a fan of this one. Either I... This could go up in value, but it's just not one. I, I collect some of the MCU ones. I don't collect, like, the superheroes as an animals ones. Like, I do have a lot of the WandaVision ones and all that. I like the Loki ones. and like most of the MCU ones, but this one's not... I would have preferred them to make, like, a new Captain America version. Something like that. So... Next thing we'll get on is to a new soda that got announced, and it is called Kaboom Cereal. This, I do not have any Funko sodas, but when I went over to Pop Culture the other day, they had quite a lot of sodas. And the, the sodas are cool. I watched the Funko Funko, um... On TV episode, and they announced a, a full sona, and it has a black light chase. Fortunately, they don't have a I don't have a picture with me right yet. Probably day three or day four, depends depends how many days there are. There might be just two, but yeah, let's move on to the next one. So the next one is an ad icon. And this is a cereal, it's called Sugar Smacks, and it is Smacky the Steel. Now, this one here is a good one. They always do add a con one for their Comic Cons, and this is a pretty good one. They, they did do a good job on, on this with the sail, sail, sailing hat and the bowl on his hand. They always do like different type of cereals, like I know that Tony the Tiger they did 
already. But uh, the Anarchon ones always go up. So uh, I reckon that this here would be like the exclusive to the Funko Shop. Um, shared to the Funko Shop. And uh, yeah, so. Pretty cool, but I don't really collect Anacons. Sort of, it depends which ones they are. So that's my answer to that one. But these next two are pretty cool, and these are ones that I might, I'm thinking of getting. So the first one is Martian Manhunter from DC Imperial. Now, I do not have any of the Imperial Palace pops, but this here looks pretty cool, especially that gold. Really like that metallic gold on him. Um, this looks great. I don't remember them making a Mar um Is it Martin? Manhana Funko Pop of Four. This is really cool. And unfortunately, there is not many Marvel ones, but this is cool to see. But there's not, there's more. There's one more. That is another DC one, and is also part of, uh, got announced for day two, is Deathstroke. This is cool, unfortunately you can't see the black on camera there, but on the picture, but this is pretty cool. I, I do not think I have a Deathstroke pop, and I sort of do like, Deathstroke is one of like the, one of my favourite characters from DC. I do know who Deathstroke is because I don't remember. Was it the Batman TV show I saw him in? Anyway, but I really like the shiny metallic on his, his armour there. A little bit of the silver. This is pretty cool. So I just have to debate between the Martian, Martin and Deathstroke. Probably Deathstroke because he does look pretty cool, but, you know, still the baby. So all of these ones are just really Tokidoki ones, so let's move on to those ones. So this is Sab Kohan. I don't even know these ones. I do know that these are Pops, though, but I do, know, do not know nothing about this, so... Not really a big fan of these ones. Um, it's cool, but just not a fan of it. And they've announced a couple, and I think one is limited. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong about that. So the next one we have is a donkey sort of type. Uh, it's a toy Tokyo exclusive, Caramello. Pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. So it's all like a fancy thing, but like I said, I know nothing about this. If it's an anime or not, I do not know. But they have another to toy Tokyo exclusive, which is Sandy. That's interesting. Did they do a mistake on that? Guys, look, you can see. All of those are capital letters, S-A-N-D, except for the Y. Did they do a mistake on that? Did they do a mistake? It, I think it, I'm not sure if it's supposed, supposed to be like that. Or not. Let me know in the comments down below. If you noticed that. That's weird. Very weird. So the next one we have is called Scooter, and yes, I was right. This is limited to 15,000 pieces. Again, I really think that this is not 15,000 pieces. I really think they could have done another one, like... Maybe Marvel, a limited Marvel one, because not many people like Toki Doki. I'm sure other people do, but like, yeah, so 
Yeah, so, and the last one we have is from G.I. Joe, and we have Combat, Cobra Bat. Now, this is pretty cool. I don't collect G.I. Joe line, but look, this is a pretty popular line. And overall, I think the, the day two reviewers are pretty good. I hope there's more Marvel, but probably won't, but make sure... Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Chad Simon and Park Kid, Cynthia, Bank Ken, Alex Stewart, and this has been another video. See you guys later.